Hello hopefuls, thanks so much for coming back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing great. I'm doing wonderful. And this haul is going to be a Dollar General Valentine's haul. And I did pick up a few other little cute planner stuff that I thought would be good to incorporate for the family. So let's get started with this haul. The first thing that I picked up was I needed a new one of these. They're $5, the Yankee Candle, and Dollar General has different scents. I can't think of the other ones, but I picked up the Bahama Breeze for my car. And how long does it say it lasts? Just up oh, 30. Mm. It only say 30 days, y'all, but I had mine for like a long time, probably like a year. But you couldn't smell it anymore. But anyway, I was long overdue for one of these. Okay, then I also, I went to two different Dollar Generals. The first thing I got was this Love, and it has the Buffalo check, and it looks like it's um, shit black wood, so this was $2.50. Little easel, and they had other styles too. And then the little car, You and Me. Um, Love, I see that they're starting to incorporate the little car everywhere. Even I saw where was we at Marshall's and they had like a little truck it was so pretty it was like teal blue with Easter eggs in the back but anyway these were a dollar they also had these in pink too so if you want to get these in pink you can so they can stand up like that they're really cute for if you have like a two tier three tier tray I got just like one of these DIY figurines and I kind of drag my feet with Dollar Tree and I don't know if I'm put that with this haul but I got some stuff from Dollar Tree um, I don't know why I just dragged my feet with the Valentine stuff and so now it's kind of picked over I did get this love um, sign here and this one is $2.50 and yeah so I get little crafts like this for Josiah so I know some of you said luxury text she said hope you should make a little segment with you and um, Josiah crafting so I'm gonna, I'm gonna think about it y'all <laughs> so happy Valentine's Day these little plates and napkins they are a dollar they also have like the smaller ones and the beverage napkins too if you want those and I think I'm gonna do something at home this year only because Jason has training or drill that day I think drill so, um, yeah, and we just do something the next day or the weekend. So, I literally can't even. I got this when I first went in there a couple weeks ago looking for the Valentine's stuff and it was nothing out. So, this was only a dollar, and I think this is part of the spring line. And they have some other ones that say, Bless this mess in a different color, which was super cute. And then um, on another aisle where they have some new spring stuff out, they have these cups. They look just like the Dollar Tree ones, but the sayings and the colors are really pretty. So I woke up like this. I like the colors. It's a two-pack of tumblers. And then they had several different rolls of ribbon, but I only got this one that says, what does it say? I'm not sure what it says, y'all. It was cut off. I think Valentine's. And love but it has a little red truck on it and it's a dollar I also got this be mine felt heart and it's only a dollar and these little hearts or things like this are good to just hang up but you can place it inside of a reef and just like use a string that's already connected or use your own string and loop it through and you instantly have a little decorated reef so that's something quick and easy you can put on your door or something like that um this little sign has several of these this is i love us and i was going to record taking you guys in there but they had all the carts in the way and was no way i had to move the cart out the way which was a tight squeeze just to get to this stuff and i couldn't get to the other diy stuff the most of the diy stuff that i did find i got at the other dollar general so they had several of these so i'll see how it is maybe if i go back today and then at the other one oh, i saw on the flyer too that they had these little boxes i thought this was cute to um maybe we'll keep it every single year get Josiah to decorate it and we'll put like our cards in it to each other and then i didn't realize to when i was laying it out that it's already perforated right here so that'll be super neat and they have different sizes so i think it's a size larger than this which I didn't see, but according to the flyer, 
and then I did see a smaller size. They had several different stickers, but of course, if you've been on my channel for a long time, you know Hope used to haul some stickers. So I have a whole organization on how all the different stickers that I have, and I tend not to um, use them all the time because I don't have time <laughs> to use them with crafting with everything else. And then there's just so many stickers, and I don't want to get rid of them. So I'm to say all that you guys know I probably have tons and tons of stickers still so I am real selective of what I pick up and these are really pretty y'all I think they had some in paint if I'm not mistaken and they're only a dollar so these are cute to put like on the back of an envelope if you're crafting um, to put on a box like this but I mainly got these to put on the box these little felt stickers. I think I did get a few from Dollar Tree. I'll show you guys and just get decided to decorate that. I don't know if we're going to paint the box or not, but I do have some red paint, I believe. I need to double check. But, yeah, these are so pretty. These are like the type, the type that you want to hoard. But anyway, these little metal trucks, how much are these? Are They were only a dollar. And they had them in pink and red. And you can put this like a little door hanger or somewhere in the kitchen or um, on a reef for decor. Like if you make wreaths, you can get several of those to put in your little stash. So a lot of times when I go in a store, y'all, I, I don't know, if do you all do that? Do you like go straight to what you're looking for and then you leave out? Sometimes I do. Sometimes I don't if I don't feel like looking around. So I did look around because I was just going to go straight to the Valentine's stuff and leave. But on the end cap they had these and I don't think they had them at the one closest to me. So I was like, oh, you don't need another planner. But I was watching Weightless Wendy and I love her channel and she had the whole planner set up like the binder system like Dollar Tree has. But the only thing, because I have several of those, I didn't get the most recent one but i haven't used it because you know i got a bunch of planners so i was like well this is the only one that i think that i will use or i can customize it and put it in any of my planners so this was a dollar but they have a whole little planner kit at dollar general then this right here it says let's eat weekly plan it was three dollars at 60 sheets i thought this would be good to put just leave it on the counter or up here on the top counter so that they can see what I'm cooking or I can pull it out and meal plan right quick. I know a lot of times in my videos I will say I'm going to do a meal plan and then I end up editing that out because it will take me so long to get the video out and then I don't kind of forgot. I can look at what I bought but I may have had something in the pantry and I already done cooked it. So this will give me a little quick glance to go ahead and just um, write it out instead of writing it out and putting it like in my planner and then I have to go back and find it anyway so I thought this was neat so this has breakfast lunch and dinner and then usually probably the lunch unless it's the weekend will be just mine and I can plan out my meals too so I thought that was neat they had a to-do list and then they had I don't remember what the other one but it had three other different designs Dollar Tree had this before, but they didn't have like this cover on it, I don't believe. And it's the Home Finance and Bill Organizer. And I need to shred a lot of papers. I'm letting it pile up because I just get the mail and leave it there. And I don't want it to pile up because um, we had to take a lot of papers to like a shred day. You know how the banks have the shred days? So, anyway. So, I'm about to do this and put everything here and I like this because Jason will know where everything is and this will stay on the counter too so it has like a due date expenses amount paid due date expenses yeah blase blase and it has a year at a glance 2021 2022 and that's okay so that's what it looks like and it has this elastic band and it was only oh lord where the price at let's see it was mm, I'll find my receipt and caption below I may be only a dollar but I have to see okay 
because it was, it was on my other receipt. Then this little planner. I did not need another little planner. It's um, it's super cute. It's not the best of quality, but because um, it just looked like they just laminated this cover. But the other one was a little bit worse than this. But it was only three dollars. But I thought it was so bright and cheerful. And if you're not really a planner person, this is probably for you. And I thought it'd be cute to put it, just leave it on the counter. I didn't get a family planner this year. And it has a few stickers in the front. And you can put this on the tabs. And then the first page is this year will be awesome. Birthdays, we're going places, um, special celebrations, important dates, big goals. And you put the year up there and then paper's thick because I thought it was something there. Some notes over here. And you have your first tab. And then you have month of holidays, appointments, date, time, and place, birthdays, notes, and get it done and goals. And then here is the monthly view. Month, year, you got this. So you can write that in. If you have tons of stickers, you can put the stickers on there. And then here is the weekly view, the week of um, Monday through Saturday. And then down here, I thought this was nice. This says lunch and dinner. And then a to do. And then it just repeats. Um, let's see. Notes. Yeah. So I can leave this out on the counter and just fold it back. And we've been using our Alexa a whole lot for reminders and it'll let me know, like of course, if I'm not in the room, I kind of hear it go off, but if I'm not in the room, it'll let give me an alert on my phone for the app. So and we have like appointments and stuff, like the boys go to the dentist. And I just don't want to forget, oh, and I just remember something. Today's the last day to sign up for spring sports. And then they have haircuts today. So I know I'll be sitting in here doing something, and it's like 6 o'clock. And I'm like, oh, the barbershop done close. So this is a really good reminder for appointments so Jason will know what's going on, too. And not just myself. So that was cute, y'all, for $3. Especially if you're not a planner person, you really don't want to invest in a planner. But that's all I picked up from Dollar General. I'll make a separate, different video for Dollar Tree. And I hope you guys are having a great day or evening. Thanks so much for watching and supporting, as always. And don't forget, there's always hope. Bye, y'all.